Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back. I'm your host, Cardmas Phoenix. Here's always bring you guys some more Mansion the Gathering Arena content today. Playing more best of three in rank standard. I'm trying to climb the ranks. Uh, I hope to be diamond by the end of the day. Um, we'll see what happens though. We are gonna keep this hand. Got double blue. We have effectively double white. Opponent is playing. Pretty, pretty thick deck, I would say. 95 cards in total. I've seen upwards of 200, but, you know. Okay, I'm going to Plains and then Lunar Pedrin. Sure. Playing Island. And pass. Play a deserted beach and tap out for a trump of seed shark. Start getting value off our off of all our non creature. Welcome to Empire. Gain a life. Go ahead and shatter Sink the Miserable for the turn. And honestly, I think I care enough about this being a card draw engine to go ahead and seal the way. So, that's what I do. I'm put it on the way, of course. And then I will go ahead and swing to and care. Pass. Pass the far. This is going to exile my Chromo Sea Shark and gain my life, putting him back up to 20. I'm just gonna play the Icon Jones in the Empire instead of using its channel ability. Play Logwood. Inspire. Okay. Sure. Alright. Play for a second Shattered Sanctum. We will go ahead and. Targeting ourselves, shuffle back our make this appear. Really just doing it to get a good card. Let's go ahead and grab Void Rend. Mirix is tempting, but I want a quick, easy way to get rid of the brutal Cathar so that we get our Seed Shark back so that I can pass it up for the full 6-6. Six, six value. We're in kind of a rough spot here because obviously with literally nothing else to do with the mana, he would be more than okay with paying the two to get the Adelina resolve. So we'll just go ahead and let it go. I'm gonna go ahead and gain a life for the 21. Now this is just a r random test. Uh, this is to see if he's going to actually swing in at all. Uh, particularly with Brew Cathar. Looks like he is going to do that. So we will transform our token so it can value block the Brutal Cathar. Which we are doing primarily because it's a free way to get our shark pack. Meaning we can play the Mirex as our land for the turn and then still get the full cast of Rascal Trail Sneak for the 6 6 value. And for that matter. Plus, you have Rascal. We will win. Another great 
both incubation tokens as well as Frasca herself proceed to end of turn. Drawn to a Rafine's Tower. Double block Adeline so that we guaranteed kill it. And then Rascal got on his heel loyalty. It's perfect because now we can play their Fiend's Tower in return. Go ahead and cast her from the and we can then uh, save our void red for now. Just go ahead and use Rascal Trail Sting ability to start parking a more. Go ahead and transform my eight swing thirteen at the opponent. From the ten pass. Play an Ironer veteran. Gain a life. Make the three three learn veteran a four four. Oh, excuse me, a five five. At this point, we really don't have to worry about anything because uh, we win, so we'll just let her die. Draw, his influence still grows. Boardrend his only blocker. Two. The game, sir. And I believe we said hello to you. We first began with not hello. Go down and bring the ending. As well as a witness the future. Triple Sun's White Sun's Twilight, Triple Prologue Pharmacist, Triple Braska's Downfall. Throwing that extra copy of White Sun's Twilight. All right, we're good. All right, we'll keep this. We kind of would prefer to mulligan it, but a five land hand is absolutely okay. I'm gonna play Island and pass turn. Island number two, pass. Oh, the 
fire assistant response. Give me a plus Deserted beach. From the sea shark. Gonna block a 1 1 with Chrome from the Sea Shark. Gonna run 17. Play. Go ahead and pass, keeping the seed shark up as a blocker. Depending on what he does this turn, yeah, see, that's, that's something that you Or he moves on to attackers. I will transform my two to just to ensure that we're being efficient with the water. We'll block the 3 4 with our 2 4 and block the 1 1 with our 2 2. That's like 20 damage and neither, none of our creatures die. We'll play the Shattered Sanctum as our lane for the turn. So, obviously the Vraska's Fall looks tempting, but what I'd actually prefer to do is Memory Deluge, even if it has to be at Sorcery Speed, so that we do guaranteed get our land, which we do not. Uh, Elish Norn Seal from Existence will do effectively the same thing, though. Go ahead and pass. Go ahead and play LSU on one of the machines. Gonna be selling for turn. Not that it really matters. We're just gonna scoop it up. Good game. Well played, fun. We'll go ahead and play another one. Deserted Beach from OC Shark. are going to in fact play it, but yeah, I'm cool with that. You just want to land stuff on some of the stuff. Let's grab Witness the Future and Deserted Beach. I don't know what game I'm gonna 
life, and because he gained life, voice of the blast will become a 3 3. Right land, he'll gain a life. Become a 4 4. Gonna play another Lunar Veteran. To level 23. And his voice of the blast is now a 5 5. Swing in from 1 down to 19. Draw. Deserted Beach. Play a Sunfall. Exile all your creatures. Inside of Board White. Or pass the turn. So since they are exiled, he cannot even cast them for the disturb cost. We'll try to get rebuilding their board with an Angelic Overseer. Excuse me. Inspiring Overseer. Uh, Angelic Overseer is in my Audrey deck. And Travel Minster. Sure. Deserted Beach. Let us... Woodrun C sharp. Pass. Sure. Take three, get them to sixteen. On your instep, we'll transform the four formation Play a Mirix. Play a Chrome Plus Sea Shark. Absence. Sure. I believe I can be made to be okay with that. Let's go ahead and witness the future. Target ourselves, shuffle everything back to the yard. Incubate four. Excuse me, three. Get our seed sharp. Get ourselves another sunfall. Very interesting. He decided to blow up our Mirex, seeing as it is a very light solution. Swing in, take us a 13. Second Mirix. We'll play the Rafine Tower first. Go ahead and Sunfall. Go down to bring the ending, remove the void runs, remove the sun falls. Go down to witness the future. Put in all three copies of White Sun's Twilight, Prologue the Pharisees, and Braska's Fall. Done sideboarding. <sighs> Excuse me. I do apologize. Uh, what? Just gonna automatically scoop? Okay, sure. <coughs> Opponent just said, I am done playing with you. 
I do not wish to face this opponent anymore. I can hey, hey, that's fair, man. I respect it. He respects his time. I I am totally on board with that. He gets to move on to the next game. I get my third rank. Win win. Hello opponent. Keep this hand. Say hello to the opponent. Go ahead and play an island. Pass. Humans again? Maybe. Planes pass. Invasion of Gabakan. Not land card for me. Oh, but we can play it. The funny thing is I believe I'm actually okay with that. If it weren't for the fact that you would get rid of our Chromo Seed Shark. Because of that I am gonna agree. Swamp return, Chromo Seed Shark. Yes. Next turn we can Shadow Sanctum to a Shielded. Start really getting our value train going. Big disparity between my opponent and I's life totals. Okay, it is. Is this mono white light gain? I see this deck so much now. Okay. Show it the apocalypse. We will go ahead and attack the seed shark. Get number two, bring it in a night. Pass, draw trigger from shield and you and then a 17. Ossification. XR. Cool. Alright, kill one, go 18. Player Fiend's Tower. There's tap to play Chromo Seed Shark. I'm gonna see Chark will swing in for two, get down to 16, pass. Voice of Blast, sure. Gain a life, go up 3-3. Three, three. Land for turn, my Lyric Veteran, go up to 18 life, 4-4. Four, four. Traveling Minster, make it a 5-5, five, five, and now it's episode 5-5. Five, five. Uh, what well, we see, a 4-4, four, four, that goes up to a 5-4, uh, five, four, and then a 6-5. Then back down to a 5 5. We'll play Elish Norn, Mother Machines, to shut down the white human figures. Swing both our Seed Sharks at him. Down 15. Five, go to seven six, flying in vigilance. Take seven, go to the club. Draw Mirix. Eternal one. Incubate six twice. I'll clean up this mess. This is gonna suck for you. I'm gonna exile your voice of blast. It will return some time later. 
gonna swing in for the full eight damage. Probably gets his battle back, sure. He doesn't do anything with Hellish Storm anyway, so. I'm just gonna skip it up. Good game, opponent. Let's go down the Voidrens, which are really only good in decks uh, in matchups where the opponent is also in blue. Go down our Sunfalls. Go down and bring the ending. Go down a Witness of the Future. Triple White Sun's Twilight. Triple Walk Prolock Fire Sis. And Triple Rescue Sunfall. Excuse me. We're done sideboarding. So this is technically playable. We play a Plains, a Mirix, and then a third Mirix taps for a blue. But I'm not sure I like this hand. So I'm gonna look at it. Much better. Put a Raska on the bottom. Actually... But bring the ending on the bottom for now. Sail is your opponent. Best of luck to you. But wilds. Plains. Island. Say go. Makes the voice the plus four three goes until five four goes back to it's a light shield array. Okay, deserted beach. Steal from existence. Next group and indestructible. Yeah, at least go ahead and make him force himself to force him to sacrifice it. Yeah, he is gonna let it get exiled, meaning he believes firmly he will be able to get it back. Gain a life, put it up to a 5 5. Travel means sure make him 6 5, 7 6, going to the Sure. Prologue the fire says. Poison counter your own card. Actually, we need to use this game. That's fine. Good job. Uh, 
I don't believe that we need to put in these. I think we do. If I lose because of that, it's on me. Keep this hand. I let your opponent. Best of luck in the final game. Island in past turn. I just noticed we had our That is, of course, the correct play there to play the Rafine Sauer. Swamp, go ahead and pass it over to you. Evolve the wilds in a forest, I imagine. Another plains. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, obviously, more than white life. Shadow Sanctum, Carmo Seashell. Very pushed rare. Opponent. Borrow time. Sure. Fiend's Tower. There's tap to play another combo siege. Valorous Dancer, move. Steal from existence, the borrowed time. Get our seed shark. Faith Pound. Swamp is our land for the turn. Activate. Yes. Pass. Life and draw a card. Do I care about that? Oh, it's a 4 4 flying vigilance. Mm -hmm. We'll go ahead and play the game anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Draw. Play shoot. Keep the two mana open for a counter spell. Pass the turn. Go ahead and make you lose two on your draw trigger. Excuse me, this is my primary care position. We're good. Um, we will also bring you this. Sorry about that, that was my primary care position. Draw a card, go up by two life. Incubate two twice. Swing in the left shoulder. Now attack with his faith on judge. Roger goes on the twelve. On the emperor. We say the thing. Go ahead and take four, gun on the eighteen. Roger to go up 20. Eternal Honor, moving 6. Try to best me, if you can. 
Exile your faith bound. I'll handle this one. Swing in with our dudes. This is eleven. Good game. Well played. Rank up to platinum. I did have fun in that game. Wasn't challenging, but it was fun. How much is this again? Oh, yeah, for fuck. Okay, never mind. Just this. Ten thousand. Yeah, thank you. Too rich for my blood. Let's go ahead and play one more. First, we are gonna mulligan this hand because we do have a white source. I feel moderately better about it, though I'm not sure I feel comfortable keeping that two lander. We'll mulligan one more time. Much, much better. Go ahead and put Braska on the bottom, as well as. This is obviously not the correct play, but I am genuinely considering blocking it just so we can save ourselves on a future poison counter. I will technically get one anyway. Probably won't be that bad, but it'll be gone. Which is all that really matters to me. Now we will witness the future target ourselves. Shuffle both back. Get a land. Play the swamp as I want to turn and pass. Double black. Effectively double white. Bracket. 
sure. Chrome has seed shark. To be fair, I run four cards. How I always have a Rafine Tower to play on turn one, and always have a Chrome Host Seed Shark to play on turn three, I honestly couldn't tell you, but that's. I mean, <laughs> hey. Thanks, Arena Shuffler. Oh, that's clever. Oh, I see. You just want to get through. Oh, oh my god. Wow. You're not even like, going to try to hide what you're doing. Good on the 15. I respect that. Oh, hey, you're look crazy for a second there. Alright. Let's pass. Get a second source of blue to really do anything. Hope he goes wide here. Take two, go to three. Okay, pass. It's starting to look like a loss. A little bit too early to tell just yet, but for sure. Anyway. There's the courtyard. Go down to 11. I give it two more turns. Technically, we could play Vraska, but it wouldn't be wise. We'll go ahead and pass. Okay, take two guys. This seems like a waste. We'll seal from existence your craft butcher. I don't know, dude. It's just how it's just how the cookie crumbled this time. Awesome. Elish Norton. You have to worry about Phoenix. That would kind of suck. Awesome. Shattered Sanctum. Pay the full six for Nebraska. My will cannot be broken. Patience. We will win. We are within a few turns from winning now, but we will also have a attack or because it's digital, it doesn't matter if it's attacking because we still have it as a blocker. Play a shield in just in case. Go ahead and pass the turn. Oh, of course we'll be on shield for bring another 10. Brass could be way more fun though. Okay. And with Shielded out, Vraska actually nets us one life because we will draw, gain two for our draw for turn, go up to nine, go down to eight off of Vraska's draw, but then go back up to ten because of the Shielder's ability. I'm just gonna scoop it up. Good game, one life. 
He did the best he could. Go down to bring the ending, go down four Vordrens, go down three Sunfall, triple Sun, White Sun, Twilight, triple Probably Fire Assist, triple Brass is Fall. Take a Witness Future. Okay, we're good to go. I know she wouldn't have taken our fun from us, but he is gonna die anyway, so. Yes, I don't mind you seeing the writing on the wall. Uh, we'll keep this hand. I see Double Elish Nord. Hello, opponent. Good luck and fun. Best luck in game two. Phyrexia and Obliterator. Now, I don't know why you think that would resolve, but it will. No, sir. No, sir. Slash. Excuse me. Sorry. Another Shadow Saint, which we got off the top. Which. Pass turn. Draw. Turn. Shield Trigger. Down to 16. Honestly, even an edict doesn't help you at this point because we still have to push Okay. Sure. Do then is we'll go ahead and play Zerid Beach. Oh, you get another 13 off the shield or trigger. With our oh, yeah, the Kneel before the Emperor of Kamigawa. First Everything else goes by. Swing four with Alishnorn, bring you 13 out of 9. To be fair, I did tell you this was gonna happen. Might be so much trouble getting here. Some time. 
go ahead and cast Prolonged Fire Assist. Give Poison Counter draw a card. Another Prolonged Fire Assist, give Poison Counter draw a card. Swing 4 with uh, Alistair Ring. I'm down to 5. this together. Draw a trigger and shield it. Uh, two. You try to play something to save yourself, it doesn't matter. Counter it. Don't have to pay for it. You pass the turn and shield it kills you on your draw step. That's a good game as it gets. Thank you for playing. That being said, we will go ahead and end the video here. Thank you all so much for watching. I've been your host, Cardmas Phoenix, signing out. Until next time, have a good one.